What is going on guys? Back in my latest video. So today I have another mystery box from Chrono Toys. This was another one of those $35 damage mystery boxes. Been doing really well with them so far, so hopefully that continues. So let's get right into this box and see what we do. Here we go. Alright guys, so before we get into this box, please smash that like button down below. Let me know you guys are enjoying these videos. Very important that you do so. And if you're not already subscribed to my YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button down below so you're updated to my most recent content. So like I said, these were 35 bucks, and they have six pops in them, and they have the opportunity to get a grail from Chrono Toys. And uh, like I said, I've been doing really well with them, getting a lot of the things that I want to add in my collection, a few other good gems as well. So hopefully we continue that streak with this. Um, Chrono Toys is one of my favorite places to order mystery boxes from. I know a lot of people ask me where the best is. They're definitely up there for me, so check them out if you have not already. So let's get right into the boxes and see how we do. No protectors as usual, so let's do these one by one. Here is the first pop. Okay. So this is one of my favorite characters growing up. This is Bartman from The Simpsons. Um, of course, I already have this one, but this is one of my favorite characters um, ever. You know, as a kid, I had the toys, uh, knew the song, everything like that. Um, I think there's was a dance doing the Bartman too. I don't know it if anyone else does. Um, but there you go, there's Bart. There's a little bit of damage right there, which kind of sucks for a common, um, but mine's actually out of the box, so. I don't know what I'm going to do with this, but if anybody's interested, let me know. Um, there's Bartman right there. Pretty cool pop, just one I already have. So, let's get into the second pop. <laughs> okay. So, this is uh, Jollibee in the Barong. I actually have this one already, um, but this is a nice ad icon. Um, this isn't the glow in the dark one or like the flocked or metallic one. This is the regular Barong Jollibee. Um, I saw that they're starting to bring Jollibees in the U.S. kind of around my area. Or not in my area, like in Jersey and Virginia, which isn't too far, so I might have to check it out one day. Um, but yeah, there's Jollibee. Hopefully, eventually, I can try the food. It hurts really good. And uh, yeah, he's the second pop from the box. Always nice to pull an ad icon. So, so far, so good. Pop I like, and an ad icon can't beat that. Alright, so number three is Tormund. So I'm getting a lot of these Game of Thrones pops through these mystery boxes, which is really nice. Um, this is from Edition 7, so this is just from 2018. It's a newer pop. Um, this was a common. I don't think this one's highly valuable. I, I could be wrong, though. Uh, but Tormund is uh, just one of the best characters from Game of Thrones. Again, if you haven't watched that show, check it out. He's probably the funniest character on the show. So there's Tormund from Game of Thrones. He's not one I already had. So slowly but surely getting... A whole lot of these Game of Thrones pops. Uh, still want to get that mountain back there. I think that was a Comic Con exclusive. If anybody out there has one, I'm definitely interested in trading for that. But there you go, Tormund right there from Game of Thrones. All right, so 35 bucks. I think I definitely have already got my value back. So let's see if we can pull some more good pops. <laughs> uh, total rookie, total rookie. This is, again, this is one of my favorite pops, but I keep pulling it, which is really crazy to think. Um, at one point, this is really sought after, and now um, there's just so many of them out there, which kind of sucks. You know, you like to keep the pops you have exclusive, um, but nothing you can do about that. Todoroki is one of my favorite looking pops of all time. And there is another one right there. This is the Glow in the Dark Edition. Pretty cool. All right, so that is the fourth pop. Hopefully these last two are something good. Here's a fifth pop. Okay, so this is the Joker as Batman. This is a Loot Crate exclusive. I've never seen this one. Um, I don't really know too much about the Loot Crate exclusives or what Loot Crate even is, um, but this one's really cool. I'm not really into all the DC pops, um, but this one is better than all those Chrome Batmans they make. Um, so definitely something different as opposed to just making him a certain color. Um, turning him to the Joker is really dope and they did a really good job with this one. He really looks pretty creepy like the Joker and uh, really a cool looking pop. I do like this one. So there you go. There's Batman as the Joker, the fifth pop in this box. Really cool. So let's see. The last one is a Grail. Um, hopefully it is. You know, it'd be nice to pull something from a, like a set I collect or 
just a valuable pop in general. Here's the last pop. Oh, okay. So I have this one already. This is the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Um, of course, I have almost all the Dragon Ball Z pops, so this one's already in my collection. Uh, this was a GameStop exclusive. This one, for whatever reason, doesn't have the sticker. Um, there's not much, if at all, any damage on this one. I guess the damage is just not having the sticker, which isn't a huge deal. Um, I do already have this pop. Maybe I'll keep it keep it out of the box because a lot of the Dragon Ball Z ones I just still have in the box, not displayed. But this one's really cool. Um, Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Can't go wrong with that. So that is all the pops in this box. Um, unfortunately, a lot of them were uh, duplicates, but you know, nothing you can do about that. That's the risk you run when you open up these mystery boxes and as many as I do. Um, but drop down in the comment section below what your favorite one was from this box. Um, please smash that like button if you've not already and hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to my channel so you're up to date, up to date with more videos just like this. Thank you so much for your support, guys. Until next time, I'll see you later.